Hi again, everyone. So, the next lesson we're going to do on the tumble is going to be twinkle twinkle. Okay. So obviously we have to make sure and practice your D scale every time you every time you pick up the tumble. Just kind of. Just keep going up and down with it. And what that does is it gets you it gets you used to playing all the different notes on the tumble and gets the fingers moving. And it's a good way of getting used to covering the holes and avoiding that kind of sound. Okay? So Twinkle Twinkle is a very simple little tune anyway. Um, if, if you've played the tone whistle at all for a little while here or there, you've, you've probably learned Twinkle Twinkle. Okay, so but we're going to run through it anyway. So we're going to start. So it starts with a D. It's probably the hardest note to cover all the, to get our, get all the notes. It's probably the hardest note to get sounding out properly because you have to cover all the notes with all your fingers like this. And if you have one, finger a tiny little bit out at all, like not covering the hole properly. You get that kind of sound, even if all the rest of them are perfect, or if this one's out, or if this one's a little bit out. So make sure and cover all the notes, keep your fingers nice and flat level, and no knuckles pointing up like that. Keep, them, keep the fingers straight, okay? So starting with the D, so we're gonna just work it work it with the different phrases. Like you've got the first phrase, second phrase, third phrase. So the first phrase is D D A A B B A. Okay? So I'll just play that fit. Okay, so again D D A A. Now two B's. And a long A. Right, once more. Good job. And the next phrase now starts on the G and works all the way down to the low D. Oops, sorry. Okay, so again, G, G, F, F, E, E, D. So G, G, F, F, E, E, and a long D. Okay, so now for the next line, a phrase, we're going to start a note above the G, and we're going to go to the A. Now I'm going to do a similar thing, I'm going to run down to the E. Again, A A G G F F and E. And so that that we phrase repeats then in the middle of the chin. So you do that twice. Okay. And then it finishes off then with the first two phrases again. So you're starting back down with the D. And again, D, D, A, A. B, D, and long A. Good. And the very, very last bit then. Whoops. So I tend to I tend to play right handed like this, but that's just years of playing it wrong. So when you're when you're practicing even if you see me picking the muscle up and putting my right hand on top like that, you're better off if you can at all get the left hand on the top notes. Okay? So 
I'm just going to play it my own normal way now so you can hear the way it's supposed to sound. Okay. Okay, thank you. See you the next time.